Hey guys, David here and welcome to another Fusion 360 tutorial. So you're all done, you've created your model and you're ready to 3D print it. But how do you get it to the printer? So inside of Fusion 360 it's rather easy actually to export your file as an STL file, which is what most 3D printing software is used. So once you have your file created, as I have here, that's the phone dock that I'm actually selling on my website link down below. So you go over here to make and there are different things here. You can either just 3D print, that's where you create your STL file, but you can also directly get a quote from different online printing services if you don't have a 3D printer yourself, which is really handy that it's built directly into it. But we're gonna go here to 3D print and this option menu here comes up and Basically what you just do is click on here and select the file that you want to export and then you have a couple options in here. You can choose your refinement, low, medium, high. Unless you're like somehow limited in space, I would just keep it on high. As these models here, they aren't created with polygons inside of here. and when these faces get rendered over to polygons, you want to have a like, decent amount of polygons so it doesn't look all weird and fun funky in your 3D printer. So I'm just gonna stick with high for basically whatever I do. And you could also use the Autodesk 3D printing utility here, then you can send it directly over, but you're probably not gonna do that, so you can just uncheck that here and then click OK. And then a window opens that allows you to save it. I'm just gonna save it here on my desktop. Click Save. And then here on my desktop I have the STL file. So just to quickly demonstrate, I'm gonna open up Cura. And once I'm inside of Cura, I go to Open File, go to my desktop again, choose it here, Open, and here you can see that the file got imported. And then you can change all your settings here. And I have separate videos that explain the different settings that you wanna consider while 3D printing. And in case you ever wanna export more than one body into a single STL file, it's not really intuitive. If you do it over the make 3D print option, you can select only one. So what you wanna do is have all the bodies that you want to export in your single file be shown and if you don't want to export a body into that file just turn it off with the light bulb and then what you want to do is instead of going over the 3d print menu you want to go over here go to your component right click on there and go to save as stl and then you get a slightly different menu where you can basically just say okay and then save it as whatever and when you then import that file you can see that i have the two different bodies into one single scl file so this was just a really quick tutorial on how to export if you liked it please leave a like down below and also consider to subscribe to this channel for more videos like this and also many many others so thanks for watching and until next time